This city was the murder capital of late medieval England, and it's not London, Oxford was the murder capital of late medieval England, with the city's male university population being the main catalyst for violence, according to new research, the homicide rate in the city was four to five times higher than that of 14th century London or York, said researchers from the University of Cambridge, who have mapped medieval England's known murder cases, it wasn't surprising, it was what I expected, Professor Manuel Eisner, lead murder map investigator and director of the University of Cambridge's Institute of Criminology, told CNN, I knew from previous publications that Oxford had a very high homicide rate. Launched by the Institute of Criminology's Violence Research Center, Medieval Murder Maps is a digital resource that plots crime scenes based on 700-year-old coroner's inquests and investigations. The original 2018 map of London has been remodeled and extended to include maps on Oxford and York. Collectively, the project has catalogued 354 homicide crime scenes in 14th century England. Of the perpetrators with a known background plotted in Oxford, 75% were identified as clericus, as were 72% of victims, a press release said. During that period, clericus most likely referred to a student or a member of the university. Historical literature on university towns suggests all have a reputation in the Middle Ages for having these problems with students rioting, being violent, misbehaving and so on, Eisner said, adding that this was a stereotype at the time that has only been confirmed by their data, the perfect storm for violence, at the time, Oxford was one of the largest and most respected centers of learning in the West, attracting international scholars. It had a population of about 7,000 to 1,500 of whom are believed to have been students. Oxford was the perfect storm for violence, Eisner said. Oxford students at the time were all male and typically agey.